full yes no questions and 80 important words for US citizenship test. Easy to learn. Have you ever claimed to be a US citizen in writing or any other way? Have you ever claimed to be a US citizen in writing or any other way? No. What does claim to be a US citizen mean? What does claim to be a US citizen mean? To tell someone that you are a US citizen. To tell someone that you are a US citizen. Have you ever registered to vote or voted in any federal, state, or local election in the United States? Have you ever registered to vote or voted in any federal, state, or local election in the United States? No. What does vote mean? What does vote mean? To elect a new leader. To elect a new leader. Do you currently owe any federal, state, or local taxes in the United States? Do you currently owe any federal, state, or local taxes in the United States? No. Do you know what owe taxes means? Do you know what owe taxes means? To owe the government money. To owe the government money. What does owe any overdue taxes mean? What does owe any overdue taxes mean? Didn't pay taxes on time. Didn't pay taxes on time. Since you became a lawful permanent resident, have you called yourself a non-resident alien on a federal, state, or local tax return or decided not to file a tax return because you considered yourself a non-resident? Since you became a lawful permanent resident, have you called yourself a non-resident alien on a federal, state, or local tax return or decided not to file a tax return because you considered yourself a non-resident? No. What is a non-resident alien? What is a non-resident alien? An alien who has not passed the green card test. An alien who has not passed the green card test. Have you ever been a member of, involved in, or in any way associated with any communist or totalitarian party anywhere in the world? Have you ever been a member of, involved in, or in any way associated with any communist or totalitarian party anywhere in the world? No. Tell me what is the Communist Party? Tell me what is the Communist Party? A party that supports communism like Cuba or China. 
A party that supports communism like Cuba or China. What is a totalitarian party? What is a totalitarian party? A party in which all people have no power. A party in which all people have no power. Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any opposition to all organized government? Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any opposition to all organized government? No. Do you understand what opposition is? Do you understand what opposition is? Disagreement with something or somebody. Disagreement with something or somebody. Have you ever been a member of or involved in world communism? Have you ever been a member of or involved in world communism? No. Have you ever associated with any group anywhere in the world that advocated any of the establishment in the United States of a totalitarian dictatorship? Have you ever associated with any group anywhere in the world that advocated any of the establishment in the United States of a totalitarian dictatorship? No. What is a totalitarian dictatorship? What is a totalitarian dictatorship? A political system in which all people have no power. A political system in which all people have no power. Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any of the overthrow by force or violence or any other unconstitutional means of the government of the United States or all forms of law? Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any of the overthrow by force or violence or any other unconstitutional means of the government of the United States or all forms of law? No. What is unconstitutional? What is unconstitutional? Not allowed by the Constitution of a country. Not allowed by the Constitution of a country. Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any of the unlawful assaulting or killing of any officer or officers of the government of the United States or of any other organized government because of their official character? Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any of the unlawful assaulting or killing of any officer or officers of the government of the United States or of any other organized government because of their official character? No. What does unlawful assaulting mean? What does unlawful assaulting mean? To attack someone violently illegal. To attack someone violently illegal. Have you ever associated with any group anywhere in the world that advocated 
any of the unlawful damage, injury, or destruction of property? Have you ever associated with any group anywhere in the world that advocated any of the unlawful damage, injury, or destruction of property? No. Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any sabotage? Have you ever advocated, supported, and promoted any sabotage? No. What is sabotage? What is sabotage? The act of damaging or destroying something. The act of damaging or destroying something. Have you ever been a member of, involved in, or in any way associated with, or have you ever provided money, a thing of value, services or labor, or any other assistance or support to a group that used a weapon or explosive with intent to harm another person or cause damage to property? Used a weapon or explosive with intent to harm another person or cause damage to property? No. What is a weapon? What is a weapon? An object such as a knife, gun, or bomb. An object such as a knife, gun, or bomb. What is explosive? What is explosive? A substance that can cause an explosion. A substance that can cause an explosion. Have you ever been a member of, involved in, or in any way associated with, or have you ever provided money, a thing of value, services or labor, or any other assistance or support to a group that... Engaged, participated in kidnapping, assassination, or hijacking or sabotage of an airplane, ship, vehicle, or other mode of transportation? Engaged, participated in kidnapping, assassination, or hijacking or sabotage of an airplane, ship, vehicle, or other mode of transportation? No. What does kidnapping mean? What does kidnapping mean? To take a person away illegally by force. To take a person away illegally by force. What is assassination? What is assassination? The murder of someone famous or important. The murder of someone famous or important. What is hijacking? What is hijacking? The use of force to take control of a vehicle. The use of force to take control of a vehicle. Have you ever been a member of, involved in, or in any way associated with, or have you ever provided money, a thing of value, services or labor, or any other assistance or support to a group that 
Threatened, attempted, tried, conspired, planned with others, prepared, planned, advocated for, or incited, encouraged others to commit any of the acts listed in items number 6.A or 6.B. Threatened, attempted, tried, conspired, planned with others, prepared, planned, advocated for, or incited, encouraged others to commit any of the acts listed in items number 6.A or 6.B. No. Do you understand what threaten means? Do you understand what threaten means? To tell someone that you will kill or hurt them. To tell someone that you will kill or hurt them. What does conspired mean? What does conspired mean? To plan secretly with other people to do something illegal. To plan secretly with other people to do something illegal. What does incited mean? What does incited mean? To encourage somebody to do something violent or illegal. To encourage somebody to do something violent or illegal. Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in torture? Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in torture? No. Do you understand the word torture? Do you understand the word torture? The act of causing great pain to someone. The act of causing great pain to someone. Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in genocide? Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in genocide? No. How do you define genocide? How do you define genocide? Killing a whole race. Killing a whole race. Have you ever participated in killing or trying to kill any person? Have you ever participated in killing or trying to kill any person? No. Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in intentionally and severely injuring or trying to injure any person? Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in intentionally and severely injuring or trying to injure any person? No. Have you ever participated in any kind of sexual contact activity or activity with any person who did not consent, did not agree, or was unable to consent, could not agree, or was being forced or threatened by you or by someone else.
Have you ever participated in any kind of sexual contact activity or activity with any person who did not consent, did not agree, or was unable to consent, could not agree, or was being forced or threatened by you or by someone else? No. What is consent? What is consent? To agree to do something. To agree to do something. Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in not letting someone practice their religion? Have you ever ordered, incited, called for, committed, assisted, helped with, or otherwise participated in not letting someone practice their religion? No. What is religion? What is religion? The belief in and worship of a God or gods. The belief in and worship of a God or gods. Have you ever participated in causing harm or suffering to any person because of their race, religion, national origin, membership in a particular social group, or political opinion? Have you ever participated in causing harm or suffering to any person because of their race, religion, national origin, membership in a particular social group, or political opinion? No. What is suffering? What is suffering? Physical or mental pain that a person. Physical or mental pain that a person. Have you ever served in, been a member of, assisted, helped, or participated in any military or police unit? Have you ever served in, been a member of, assisted, helped, or participated in any military or police unit? No. What is a military unit? What is a military unit? A group that works for a government to fight in a war. A group that works for a government to fight in a war. Have you ever served in, been a member of, assisted, helped, or participated in any armed group, a group that carries weapons? For example, paramilitary unit, a group of people who act like a military group but are not part of the official military, self-defense unit, vigilante unit, rebel group, or guerrilla group? Have you ever served in, been a member of, assisted, helped, or participated in any armed group, a group that carries weapons, for example, paramilitary unit, a group of people who act like a military group but are not part of the official military, self-defense unit, Vigilante unit, rebel group, or guerrilla group? No. What is a paramilitary unit? What is a paramilitary unit? A group that acts like a military unit, but is not official. A group that acts like a military unit, but is not official.
Have you ever worked, volunteered, or otherwise served in a place where people were detained, forced to stay, for example, a prison, jail, prison camp, a camp where prisoners of war or political prisoners are kept, detention facility or labor camp, or have you ever directed or participated in any other activity that involved detaining people? Have you ever worked, volunteered, or otherwise served in a place where people were detained, forced to stay, for example, a prison, jail, prison camp, a camp where prisoners of war or political prisoners are kept, detention facility or labor camp, or have you ever directed or participated in any other activity that involved detaining people? No. What does to be detained mean? What does to be detained mean? Held in custody by police. Held in custody by police. What is a prison camp? What is a prison camp? A place where prisoners of war are kept. A place where prisoners of war are kept. What is a detention facility? What is a detention facility? A place where people are forced to stay. A place where people are forced to stay. What is a labor camp? What is a labor camp? A place where people are forced to work. A place where people are forced to work. Were you ever a part of any group or did you ever help any group, unit, or organization that used a weapon against any person or threatened to do so? Were you ever a part of any group or did you ever help any group, unit, or organization that used a weapon against any person or threatened to do so? No. If you answered yes to item number 10.a when you were part of this group or when you helped this group, did you ever use a weapon against another person? If you answered yes to item number 10.a when you were part of this group or when you helped this group, did you ever use a weapon against another person? No. If you answered yes to item 10.a when you were part of this group or when you helped this group, did you ever threaten another person that you would use a weapon against that person? If you answered yes to item 10.a when you were part of this group or when you helped this group, did you ever threaten another person that you would use a weapon against that person? No. Have you ever sold, provided, or transported weapons or assisted any person in selling, providing, or transporting weapons which you knew or believed would be used against another person? Have you ever sold, provided, or transported weapons or assisted any person in selling, providing, or transporting weapons which you knew or believed would be used against another person? No. 
Have you ever received any weapons training, paramilitary training, or any other military type training? Have you ever received any weapons training, paramilitary training, or any other military type training? No. What is weapons training? What is weapons training? Learn how to use a gun. Learn how to use a gun. What is paramilitary training? What is paramilitary training? Learn how to fight in combat. Learn how to fight in combat. What is military type training? What is military type training? Learn how to fight in combat. Learn how to fight in combat. Have you ever recruited, asked, enlisted, signed up, conscripted, required to join, or used any person under 15 years of age to serve in or help an armed group, or attempted or worked with others to do so? Have you ever recruited, asked, enlisted, signed up, conscripted, required to join, or used any person under 15 years of age to serve in or help an armed group, or attempted or worked with others to do so? No. What does attempt mean? What does attempt mean? Try to do something. Try to do something. Have you ever used any person under 15 years of age to take part in hostilities or attempted or worked with others to do so? Have you ever used any person under 15 years of age to take part in hostilities or attempted or worked with others to do so? No. Have you ever participated in combat or providing services related to combat, such as serving as a messenger or transporting supplies? Have you ever participated in combat or providing services related to combat, such as serving as a messenger or transporting supplies? No. Do you know what hostilities are? Do you know what hostilities are? Acts of fighting in a war. Acts of fighting in a war. Tell me what is combat. Tell me what is combat. A fight, especially during a war. A fight, especially during a war. Have you ever committed, agreed to commit, asked someone else to commit, helped commit, or tried to commit a crime or offense for which you were not arrested? Have you ever committed, agreed to commit, asked someone else to commit, helped commit, or tried to commit a crime or offense for which you were not arrested? No. What does commit mean? What does commit mean? To do something wrong or illegal. To do something wrong or illegal. 
What is a crime? What is a crime? An action that breaks the law. An action that breaks the law. What is an offense? What is an offense? A minor crime. A minor crime. What does to be arrested? What does to be arrested? To be handcuffed by the police. To be handcuffed by the police. Have you ever been arrested, cited, detained, or confined by any law enforcement officer, military official in the U.S. or elsewhere, or immigration official for any reason, or been charged with a crime or offense? Have you ever been arrested, cited, detained, or confined by any law enforcement officer, military official in the U.S. or elsewhere, or immigration official for any reason, or been charged with a crime or offense? No. What does to be cited? What does to be cited? Given a ticket by police. Given a ticket by police. What does to be confined? What does to be confined? To be kept in a place. To be kept in a place. What does to be charged? What does to be charged? To be accused of having done something illegal. To be accused of having done something illegal. If you received a suspended sentence, were placed on probation, or were paroled, have you completed your suspended sentence, probation, or parole? If you received a suspended sentence, were placed on probation, or were paroled, have you completed your suspended sentence, probation, or parole? No. What is a suspended sentence? What is a suspended sentence? Delaying a sentence. Delaying a sentence. Explain to me what probation is. Explain to me what probation is. You report to an officer regularly instead of jail time. You report to an officer regularly instead of jail time. What does parole mean? What does parole mean? Allowed to leave the prison early due to good behavior. Allowed to leave the prison early due to good behavior. Have you ever engaged in prostitution, attempted to procure or import prostitutes or persons for the purpose of prostitution, or received any proceeds or money from prostitution? 
Have you ever engaged in prostitution, attempted to procure or import prostitutes or persons for the purpose of prostitution, or received any proceeds or money from prostitution? No. Do you know what procure means? Do you know what procure means? To find a prostitute for somebody. To find a prostitute for somebody. Please tell me what a prostitute is. Please tell me what a prostitute is. Someone who has sex for money. Someone who has sex for money. What is prostitution? What is prostitution? The work of a prostitute. The work of a prostitute. Have you ever manufactured, cultivated, produced, distributed, dispensed, sold or smuggled, trafficked any controlled substances, illegal drugs, narcotics or drug paraphernalia in violation of any law or regulation of a U.S. state, the United States, or a foreign country? Have you ever manufactured, cultivated, produced, distributed, dispensed, sold or smuggled, trafficked any controlled substances, illegal drugs, narcotics or drug paraphernalia in violation of any law or regulation of a U.S. state, the United States, or a foreign country? No. What does smuggle mean? What does smuggle mean? To take things to a country illegally. To take things to a country illegally. What are controlled substances? What are controlled substances? Legal drugs that can be bought with a prescription. Legal drugs that can be bought with a prescription. What are illegal drugs or narcotics? What are illegal drugs or narcotics? Like heroin or cocaine. Like heroin or cocaine. Have you ever been married to more than one person at the same time? Have you ever been married to more than one person at the same time? No. Have you ever married someone in order to obtain an immigration benefit? Have you ever married someone in order to obtain an immigration benefit? No. What is an immigration benefit? What is an immigration benefit? Things like a visa, green card, or citizenship. Things like a visa, green card, or citizenship. Have you ever helped anyone to enter or try to enter the United States illegally? Have you ever helped anyone to enter or try to enter the United States illegally? No. What does illegally mean? What does illegally mean? In a way that is not allowed by the law. 
in a way that is not allowed by the law. Have you ever gambled illegally or received income from illegal gambling? Have you ever gambled illegally or received income from illegal gambling? No. Tell me what illegal gambling means. Tell me what illegal gambling means. To play a game for money is not allowed under the law. To play a game for money is not allowed under the law. Have you ever failed to support your dependents, pay child support, or to pay alimony? Have you ever failed to support your dependents, pay child support, or to pay alimony? No. What does pay alimony mean? What does pay alimony mean? To pay money to an ex spouse after a divorce. To pay money to an ex spouse after a divorce. Have you ever made any misrepresentation to obtain any public benefit in the United States? Have you ever made any misrepresentation to obtain any public benefit in the United States? No. How do you define misrepresentation? How do you define misrepresentation? The act of giving false information. The act of giving false information. What is a public benefit? What is a public benefit? Welfare like food stamps, housing, or health care. Welfare like food stamps, housing, or health care. Have you ever given any U.S. government official any information or documentation that was false, fraudulent, or misleading? Have you ever given any U.S. government official any information or documentation that was false, fraudulent, or misleading? No. Do you know what false is? Do you know what false is? It means not true. It means not true. What is fraudulent? What is fraudulent? To be dishonest or intending to deceive. To be dishonest or intending to deceive. What is misleading? What is misleading? Giving somebody the wrong idea. Giving somebody the wrong idea. Have you ever lied to any U.S. government official to gain entry or admission into the United States or to gain immigration benefits while in the United States? Have you ever lied to any U.S. government official to gain entry or admission into the United States or to gain immigration benefits while in the United States? No. What does lie mean? 
What does lie mean? To say something that is not true. To say something that is not true. Have you ever been placed in removal, rescission, or deportation proceedings? Have you ever been placed in removal, rescission, or deportation proceedings? No. Do you understand what rescission is? Do you understand what rescission is? To take back a decision. To take back a decision. What is deportation proceeding? What is deportation proceeding? Process for moving or deporting a person. Process for moving or deporting a person. Have you ever been removed or deported from the United States? Have you ever been removed or deported from the United States? No. What does to be deported mean? What does to be deported mean? To be forced to leave a country. To be forced to leave a country. Are you a person born as a male who lived in the United States at any time between your 18th and 26th birthdays? Are you a person born as a male who lived in the United States at any time between your 18th and 26th birthdays? Yes or no? If you answered yes to item number 22.A, did you register for the Selective Service? No. If you answered yes to item 22B, provide information about your registration. Have you ever left the United States to avoid being drafted in the U.S. Armed Forces? Have you ever left the United States to avoid being drafted in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. What does avoid being drafted mean? What does avoid being drafted mean? To prevent being selected as a soldier. To prevent being selected as a soldier. Do you know what U.S. Armed Forces are? Do you know what U.S. Armed Forces are? U.S. Military? Navy, Air Force, Space Force. U.S. Military, Navy, Air Force, Space Force. Have you ever applied for any kind of exemption from military service in the U.S. Armed Forces? Have you ever applied for any kind of exemption from military service in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Have you ever served in the U.S. Armed Forces? Have you ever served in the U.S. Armed Forces? No.
Are you currently a member of the U.S. Armed Forces? Yes or no? If you answered yes to item number 26.a, are you scheduled to deploy outside the United States, including to a vessel, within the next three months? Yes or no? If you answered yes to item number 26.a, are you currently stationed outside the United States? Yes or no? If you answered no to item number 26.a, are you a former U.S. military service member who is currently residing outside of the U.S.? No. Have you ever been court-martialed or have you received a discharge characterized as other than honorable, bad conduct, or dishonorable while in the U.S. Armed Forces? Have you ever been court-martialed or have you received a discharge characterized as other than honorable, bad conduct, or dishonorable while in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Have you ever been discharged from training or service in the U.S. Armed Forces because you were an alien? Have you ever been discharged from training or service in the U.S. Armed Forces because you were an alien? No. What does to be discharged mean? To be allowed to leave the armed forces. To be allowed to leave the armed forces. Do you know what alien is? Do you know what alien is? A person who lives in a country but is not a citizen. A person who lives in a country but is not a citizen. Have you ever deserted from the U.S. Armed Forces? Have you ever deserted from the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Do you now have or did you ever have a hereditary title or an order of nobility in any foreign country? Do you now have or did you ever have a hereditary title or an order of nobility in any foreign country? No. What is a hereditary title? What is a hereditary title? A royal title such as a prince or princess. A royal title such as a prince or princess. Do you know what an order of nobility is? Do you know what an order of nobility is? A position given by a king or queen. A position given by a king or queen. If you answered yes to item number 30A, are you willing to give up any inherited titles or orders of nobility that you have in a foreign country at your naturalization ceremony? Yes. Do you support the Constitution and form of government of the United States? 
Do you support the Constitution and form of government of the United States? Yes. What is Constitution? What is Constitution? It's the supreme law of the land. It's the supreme law of the land. What is the form of government of the United States? What is the form of government of the United States? Republic. Republic. Do you understand the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Do you understand the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Yes. Do you know what allegiance is? Do you know what allegiance is? To be loyal to something. To be loyal to something. Are you unable to take the oath of allegiance because of a physical or developmental disability or mental impairment? Are you unable to take the oath of allegiance because of a physical or developmental disability or mental impairment? No. What is the oath of allegiance to the United States? What is the oath of allegiance to the United States? A promise to be loyal to the United States. A promise to be loyal to the United States. Are you willing to take the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Are you willing to take the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Yes. If the law requires it, are you willing to bear arms on behalf of the United States? If the law requires it, are you willing to bear arms on behalf of the United States? Yes. What does bear arms mean? What does bear arms mean? To own or use a gun to fight. To own or use a gun to fight. If the law requires it, are you willing to perform non-combatant services in the U.S. Armed Forces? If the law requires it, are you willing to perform non-combatant services in the U.S. Armed Forces? Yes. What are non-combatant services? What are non-combatant services? Services that do not involve combat or hiding. Services that do not involve combat or hiding. If the law requires it, are you willing to perform work of national importance under civilian direction? If the law requires it, are you willing to perform work of national importance under civilian direction? Yes. What is work of national importance? What is work of national importance? 
tasks that are important to a nation during a crisis. Tasks that are important to a nation during a crisis. What is a civilian direction? What is a civilian direction? A direction from a person who is not in the military. A direction from a person who is not in the military. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more.